Welcome to Drawn in 60 Seconds, where I give you a rapid run-through of a topic in history. Today I'm going to explain some of the reasons Japan attacked Pearl Harbor on December 7th, 1941. Japan's economy heavily relied on imported resources, especially oil and steel. The United States, in an attempt to pressure Japan to withdraw from China, placed economic sanctions on Japan, which severely impacted her economy. Japan saw the sanctions as a threat to their sovereignty and believed that a military solution was necessary. Pearl Harbor was home to the US Pacific Fleet and its location in Hawaii was a strategic point for American operations in the Pacific. Japan saw the Pacific Fleet as a significant obstacle to their plan to dominate the Asia-Pacific region and felt that destroying it would give them time to establish their dominance. Japan's military leaders believed that a preemptive strike on the United States was necessary to ensure Japan's survival. They believed that the United States was preparing to enter the war anyway and that by attacking first, that would give Japan an advantage in the conflict. These three reasons, among others, helped draw the United States into World War II.